The Zoom HD makes an excellent video player thanks to its OLED screen and 720p HDMI output. But getting your videos on the Zoom has become kind of tricky. Windows 10 broke this video converter built into the Zoom software, so if you want videos on your Zoom HD, you'll have to convert them in a third-party program. So today, let's take a step-by-step -step look at how to do just that. Coming over to the computer here, we will need three things to do this. First is a video we want on our Zoom HD. In my case, I'm using this JVC monitor showcase video I made a few days ago. Second is a piece of software called Handbrake. I'll leave a link to where you can download this in the description box down below. But for those of you who aren't familiar with it, Handbrake is a completely free and open source video converter that has been around for almost 18 years and works very well. And the last thing you'll need are these two handbrake presets I've created. The link to download these will be in the description down below. Okay, so to get started, we'll need to fire up handbrake. Then you can choose to open a folder or a file. In this case, I'll pick a file. Then navigate to the video I want on my Zoom HD and select it. Then once it's open, I'll come to the top and click presets, import file, and then select the handbrake presets you downloaded earlier. There are two available, one for 272p and the other for 720p. If you only plan to watch this video on your Zoom HD, select the 272p option. But if you wanna watch it on a TV via the Zoom's HDMI output, you'll want to select 720p. It's going to throw up this error because I already have this preset added, but I'll just click on overwrite. And now that the preset has been added, I'll select it by clicking the preset dropdown, then navigating to custom presets and select it. Then down here at the bottom, just choose where you want the converted video to be placed on your computer. I'll put mine in the my videos folder because that's where the Zoom software looks for videos. And that's it. The preset will take care of all the settings. You can just go ahead and click start in code and you should see the progress along the bottom here. Depending on your computer, this encoding process might take a while, so I'll fast forward the video here and meet you back when it's done. Okay, now you should see it says Q finished at the bottom. Mine has an error because my computer crashed, but yours should have went fine. We can now close out of Handbrake and open the Zoom software. And if you're not familiar with the Zoom software, I'll leave a link to my tutorial up in the corner, but if you go over to the video tab, your video should appear here as long as you put it in the right folder. And we can go ahead and connect our Zoom HD. There it is. And we can just drag and drop the video onto the Zoom HD. And it'll start copying over. Depending on the size of your video, it may take a while. But once it finishes, we can disconnect our Zoom HDs and play the video. And with that, that completes this tutorial. If this video helped you out, be sure to let me know in the comments section down below. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, hit like, get subscribed, and ring the bell so you get notified when I post new videos. And I will see you guys in the next one.